This project is designed to look at and investigate how water movement in, is affected by sodic soils. This site will help improve our understanding of sodic soils by allowing us to do a, a deeper investigation both in the field and in the laboratory. Well, if this, there's a sodic, sodic condition, there can be dispersion of soils which, when they're wet, make them soft, and when they're dry, it makes them hard. Try and assess this with what's called a cone penetrometer. So the cone penetrometer is a device that measures the resistance to insertion of a rod with a cone-shaped tip on it as we go down deeper and deeper into the profile. The salts, especially the sodium, is influencing the water management and that water management then is interacting with our nitrogen management. So what we think is happening uh, based on our preliminary data is that the sodium is um, concentrated in the lower soil layers um, where there tends to be um, heavier clayey textures. The information today is a great start to understanding water management and our soils for ag producers in this area. We know that productive land is not limited nor inexhaustible. We've brought research together with our producers and also Extension and NRCS so that we can continually help grow our producers and their knowledge and what they need to know. Well, we've had trouble with uh, salinity in some of our fields for a long time and we've been sort of unsure about the best management practices for uh, dealing with that, you know. How do you get a decent crop off the saltiest ground? And Hopefully, over the next few years, we'll find out uh, some good ways to deal with it.